And I think the most important thing to think about is your little one coming up. Just three weeks of her pregnancy to go and Kiara is having a vaccine to protect her baby from the moment she's born. The jab is against RSV, a common cause of coughs and colds, but a virus that can result in life-threatening breathing difficulties, particularly in the winter. One of my worry was to face a possible illness of the baby during this time. And yeah, the idea of reducing that risk is great for me. Albie got RSV when he was just six weeks old, one of 20,000 babies a year admitted to hospital with the virus. He needed help with his breathing but recovered. Now pregnant again, Amy can have the vaccine this time. She's anxious not to relive the nightmare. He was so covered by machines and tubes, you, could, you couldn't even see his face. He was just like a bundle of blankets and all of these tubes coming off him. Um, it was, yeah, it was, it's, it's such a helpless feeling and nothing I would ever want anyone to experience or go through, ever. The vaccine should reduce the risk of severe lung disease in the first six months of life by 70%. Currently, 20 to 30 babies a year die in England alone. What's so good about giving the vaccine to a pregnant woman is that she will be then able to pass on the, her immunity to her baby. So from the moment her baby's born, her baby is protected. There is a second spike of RSV cases in the elderly and the vaccine is being rolled out to those aged between 75 and 79. That will reduce the risk of pneumonia. NHS England hopes the vaccine will reduce hospital admissions by 7,500 in the first year of the rollout, reducing pressure on the NHS and saving lives. Thomas Moore, Sky News.